Do you ever feel like you double leg and then they always catch you in a guillotine choke and you don't know what to do about it? I've got the answer right here. Watch this clip of what I did in one of my fights and then I'm gonna show you exactly how to do it. Now I'm gonna show you how to do exactly just that. So the first thing that's gonna happen is you're gonna shoot for a double leg, right? You're gonna be right here, you're gonna shoot in. Let's say I shot in, but instead of having my neck up here, like I'm supposed to, I make a mistake and I have my head going forward, as a lot of beginners do. A lot of pros do that as well, it's fine. We all make that mistake. But let's say I do, I shoot in and my head is forward. Now she goes in and grabs a guillotine choke, right? Now I'm not gonna commit and keep going forward because then these legs are gonna end up around my waist and then she's gonna actually be able to do a guillotine choke. She could also do it standing, sometimes they do, but look at what I do now. I take this arm, the one on the opposite side of my head, just reach across and I have this arm. Now the next step is I need to go under and in between that crotch. So have a look, I go straight up, I grab as much of that pelvis as I can, and I lift. Now, you know what to do, the rest is obvious. Now there's also a variation where you can do a choke here. So have a look what I do with this side. I keep lifting this pelvis and don't allow it to come down. I put my shoulder, I put my shoulder on that chin, and then I crank up that hip. There we go. That's the top. You good? <laughs> Take that with you guys. If ever anyone tries to submit you standing in a guillotine choke, you know exactly what to do. Just let them do it. <laughs> anyway, you got this. Train hard, fight easy. Now I'm gonna make sure she doesn't beat me up after this. 